people asked in the past, you know I love them. Look what I've found here. Now this is a Meyer and Berger machine and fabric. Hopefully that pronunciation is correct. And it's from Bruner Machine Tools. And I got the date, 1969. So it's not quite as old as me. Yes, I know you're surprised by that, but I can guarantee it. And as Chris, my cameraman said, oh, we're going to work hard again as usual. This is obviously a very versatile machine because all the knobs and buttons and things on it. So there you've got your axes turning. Another axes there. There you go, and changing the tooling, nice and simple. So as you can see from this, yes, it is a lathe, but if I turn this handle here and lift this, you've got, oh, it's flipping heavy for starters though, I'm gonna say it is heavy, that will convert into a mill. So lathe and a mill, but we're not gonna stop there. I've got the original manual. Sorry guys, just juggling. I was a clown in my past life, clearly. So there you go multi-purpose machine tool hold on guys hold on original manual there you go look at that come on chris get your get your lens in there my friends steady with three jaws a bit more there but the reason we mention this is so facing lathe center lathe vertical milling machine horizontal milling machine high speed drilling machine so how's that for first time? but we don't stop there Vertical coordinate drilling machine and slotting machine. And last but not least, horizontal boring machine. So how is that for versatile? Now I understand that these were, this is 1969, but originally used on new boats. So small footprint, exceptionally versatile. And let's see a, a feel for how big components are. We've got the face plate down here that goes on the lay. That is huge in comparison to the size of the actual machine. So there you go. Meyer and Berger, machine and fabric, 1969. Fantastic blast from the past.